Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. That is the R in the RK Stumbling Bear, and I'm a reader and a writer. And today I'm here to do my Reindeer Readathon TBR. If I remember right, this is primarily the brainchild of Eric over at Break Even Books. I actually saw Coffee Over Apples do her announcement video first. She's one of the co-hosts, signed up, and I am on team stocking. And these are my prompts. So the first prompt is Dasher, which is a short story, short fiction, or a novella. And I chose to go for a novella. And what I chose was Remote Control by Nanetti Akorafor. And this is about Sankofa, who is known as the Daughter of Death. And there's a strong sci-fi element to this as well, from what I understand. I don't know too much. I just really trust Nanetti's writing. I have liked everything I've read by her so far, so I'm excited to finally get to read this. Next prompt is Dancer, a favorite author, and a reread counts. And so I decided to treat myself to my favorite book, which is Space Cadet by Robert Heinlein. I have a digital copy on my Kindle, so I don't have so I'll have a picture posted here, most likely. And this is about Matt and Text and their friends as they go to college, basically is what it is. But this college is to be part of the patrol, which is not a military organization. It's more of a diplomatic organization with a strong emphasis on gaining knowledge in order to work through conflicts otherwise. And this is one of Heinlein's juvenile series and is one of the books that really won my love for science fiction as a whole. Then the next prompt is Prancer and it has to have a travel element. And I chose this specifically because it's a space opera and space opera is known to you're traveling through space. And I chose The Last Watch by J.S. Dews and this is about a spaceship that is trying to outrun a collapse of part of the universe. So the next I don't have yet physically with me, it's waiting for me at the library, but the prompt is Vixen, and it's for a book that has recently caught my eye. And for this one, I chose Elder Race by Adrian Tchaikovsky. I saw a really great review for this, and before the review was done, I had already requested it from my library. It's given me Arrival vibes, um, first Contact, Aliens, and I'm excited to see how this goes. The next is Comet, or a five-star prediction, and for this I have chosen A Piece Divided by Tanya Huff. This is actually number seven in her series. It, this is number seven in her Confederation series, and number two in the, I think it's the Peace series. So Tanya Huff has a, the Confederation series, which is five books, and then afterwards she released three more books, like five years later. And so this is the part of the trilogy, but what's going on is directly influenced by those first five books. And I've been loving the last few so far, so I'm pretty sure that this is going to be a five star for me as well. Next prompt is Cupid. And this is a new-to-me author. And for this, I have chosen Escaping First Contact by T.S. Beyer. This is also the Interstellar Book Club pick, and I figure it's a great way to read my book club book for the month of December and also read something by a new author. The next prompt is Donner, and then this is to read a book that is primarily red or green. And for that, I chose The Last Emperor by John Scalzi. This is the last book in his Interdependency series. And it has red and green on it, but I get more green than red from it. And even, and the end pages are green as well. So I'm going with this for my Donner prompt. And then the next prompt is Blitzen. I am going to insert here my randomly chosen dice roll for my book. All right, so for prompt Blitzen, these are the three books that I have decided to be my random choice. I have Inherit the Flame by Megan O'Keefe, Annihilation Aria by Michael R. Underwood, and The Echo Wife by Sarah Gailey. 
and I am going to roll a dice. And so how I'm going to do this, since this is six-sided dice, is if it's one, two, three, four, five, or six. So they each get two out of six chances. I don't know why I'm doing this with my left hand, because I'm right-handed. Four! Inherit the flame by Megan O'Keefe. That is the book I shall be reading to fulfill the Blitzen prompt. This is the third book in the Scorch Continent series, and I am excited to finish this adventure with Deaton Handy. So for the last of the standard prompts, I have Rudolph, which is to read a standalone. And for that, I have chosen Winter's Orbit by Everina Maxfield, by Everina Maxwell. And this is about court politics and an arranged marriage. And from what I understand, the arranged marriage partner might also be a murder suspect. So that is my last prompt for the standard prompts. So for the next prompts, I haven't actually chosen anything. I wanted to first see if I can get through the books I have already chosen for the normal ones. And if so, then I will add something onto my reading. But the prompts are Christmas Star, which is read to, which is to read a book of over 500 pages. Christmas Lights is to read an ebook, which I don't read a lot of ebooks, so that's one reason why I haven't chosen prompts for these. And then we have Christmas Carols, which is to read an audiobook. I also rarely do audiobooks. I just like my physical books. It's a lot easier for me. And it's a great break away from technology. And then last is Slaying It, which after you complete all the prompts and the extra prompts, you can repeat a prompt for extra bonus points. Like I said, I'm first going to work on my standard prompts, and then after that, I will see if I can hit any of these other prompts. And this is going to be my Reindeer TBR. Are you also participating in this readathon? If so, please let me know, and also let me know what team you're on. Thank you, and have a great day!